In this video, I'm going to show you how to use iOS launch screens. Just like a view, you can add things to a launch screen, but only background color, label, or an image view. Those are the only things you can do on a launch screen. So I'm going to create an iOS project here, and we'll make a simple launch screen. So by default, the view is selected, but the launch screen is added to your project. So you can just click on that. And again, it looks just like a view, but you can only do three things with it. So if I go to the inspector, you can see there's an option to change the background color. So I'll do that. And then going back to the library, I can pick one of the two controls. So I can add a label. And I'll just use that for the title of the app. Center it, change the color. You do whatever you want here to make it look the way you want. I'll make the text a bit bigger. And just tweak in the auto layout so things are centered quite the way I want. And now I'm going to add an image. So first I will add the image to the project. And then I can add an image view to the launch screen and position it so it's centered right in the center there. I'll choose the image I added to the project. And then I will tell this to run on the iOS iPhone 10 simulator. And then when you run it, you're going to briefly see the launch screen pop up here. That was very fast, very fast. So I'm going to run that again in slow motion so you can see it. So you see it fades in, it fades out. And for most apps, you're not going to need it. But if your app has a longer startup process, it's very handy. And that's how you set up a launch screen in your iOS apps.